before the Miami Dolphins conducted practice at the Baptist Health Training Complex on the grounds of Hard Rock Stadium on Tuesday, head coach Brian Flores spoke to the media. Here were the highlights of that session. Flores said it was a tough decision to release Benardrick McKinney, but likes the players in the linebacker room. Said there were variables involved in that decision, but spoke highly of McKinney. The Dolphins will go through practice before finalizing the roster decisions to get down to 53. Flores says he met Mac Jones at the Senior Bowl and has a lot of respect for him. Very good college player, did a lot of great things there. Emphasizes it's not the Dolphins versus Mac Jones, it's the Dolphins versus the Patriots. Preparations for Game 1 have begun but they're still in the very early stages. Elandon Roberts is doing everything he can to come all the way back from Pup. We feel good about where he is. Flores says that factored in some of the decisions. Will Fuller won't be available for week one as he serves the last game of his NFL suspension, and Flores says it buys one week to make one decision. Liam Eichenberg and Javon Holland both will be practicing today. They missed the preseason finale with injuries. Regarding the offensive line, Flores says that group is tough, smart, competitive. They try to improve every day. We've seen that through the course of training camp. Durval Kairaz Nedu has done a great job of training, nutrition and everything to give himself an opportunity to compete. We'll see. He's eager to play. All the receivers are working their way back. Practice is a walk through today, so Albert Wilson will be out there. Guard Solomon Kindley was the only projected starting offensive lineman to play in the preseason finale. We just wanted to get him some more work. Flores says they all wanted to play. Flores says he's pleased with the work of center guard Michael Deiter this summer. Flores confirms that rookie tackle Larnell Coleman is headed to IR, says he got hurt during the game at Cincinnati. Reed Sinnott had an impressive preseason finale at Cincinnati and Flores praises the growth he's seen from him all summer. Says he sees Sinnott trending in the right direction and continuing to improve.